Little Orphan Annie by James Whitcomb Riley. Little Orphan Annie's come to our house to stay and, and wash the cups and saucers up and, and brush the crumbs away and, and, and shoo the chickens off the porch and, and dust the hearth and sweep and, and make the fire and bake the bread and earn her board and keep. And all us other children, when the supper things is done, we sit around the kitchen fire and has the most is fun listening to the witch tales that Annie tells about. And the goblins, they'll get you if you don't watch out. Once, there is this little boy who wouldn't say his prayers. And when he went to bed at night and way upstairs, his mammy heard him holler. His daddy heard him bawl. And when they turned the covers down, he wasn't there at all. And, and they searched him in the, the cubby hole and rafter room and, and, and press, and they searched him up the chimney flue and, and everywhere, I guess. But all they ever found was just his pants and roundabout. The goblins will get you if you don't watch out. Once, once there was this little girl who'd always laugh and grin and make fun of everyone and all her blood and kin, and once when there was company and old folks was there, she mocked him, and she, and she shocked him, and she said she didn't care. <laughs> and just as she kicked her heels and turned to run and hide, there was two great big black things standing by her side. And they snatched her through the ceiling before she knew what was about. <laughs> and the goblins will get you if you don't watch out. Little Orphan Annie says, when the blaze is blue, and the lamp wick sputters, and the, the wind goes Then <laughs> you better mind your teachers and your parents fond and dear, and cherish them that loves you, and, and dry the orphan's tear, and help the poor and needy ones that clusters all about. The goblins will get you if you don't watch it.